Hi, my name is Chris Hart. I'm a cartoonist, and today I'd like to show you how to draw a face in a downward position. Slight angle down, rather than just everything straight ahead. It adds a little variety, and some people have a little difficulty with this. They make it look like the person is just looking down, but their face is straight up. Actually, to make it make the down look, we have to have the center line, which is right here, and the, the eye line goes lower than halfway. And we're going to rest the eyes like so. All right, so we're already positioning the character to look down. It's a little bit of a smaller nose. Let me put some eyes in here, some eyeballs. Get started. I'm going to slenderize him slightly because it's a down look and kind of makes everything look a little more slender. She can still look up at us. Kind of a uh, mysterious look. But we're going to make her look down. Now, when you have a character in the down position, their lips are closer to the nose than they usually are. It just looks at ways compressed because of the perspective. And notice that we taper more toward a point than just keeping sort of a round face at this angle. Notice that taper right there. It gives an interesting little flare to a look. Give her some ears here. And Eyebrows follow the contour of the upper eyes. Now let's, let's make some nice eyes for her here. Some dramatic eyes with the eyelashes feathering upward. And we're going to darken the eyelashes more, the eye line. And why don't we give her two toned eyes right here, two toned eyes. Uh, to do that, we're also going to have to shade a little bit inside of the eyes on the top and blend it in. Dark on top and sort of blending that in. Clean that up a little bit. Eyelids. Let's give a little more smile on the other side too. And darken in the top lip. Now you'll see that because she's facing downward, she has more hair showing, more of the forehead and upper head showing. Now I'm going to thin this out a little on the sides. Always making adjustments as you go, depending on what looks right to you. And everything changes. Drawing is very dynamic. When you change one thing, everything else changes on it. So sometimes you have to adjust. And some people think it's bad to erase. Usually people who haven't really had that much experience with it, they think, oh, that's supposed to erase. But that's, it's, erasing is part of drawing. Okay, a little shading here. A little shadow under the neck, under the uh, chin, I mean. And there you have it. Looking slightly down gives the character a little bit of an angle. I'm going to just shave a touch off here so it slopes. So I like it to take a definite turn. There. That's a little better, I think. Well, that's it. If you'd like to see more of my stuff, or uh, discuss cartoons. I have a Facebook fan page. Also, my website is www.chrisheartbooks.com. And I hope you enjoy more of my YouTubes. Thanks for stopping by. See you next time.